Our feeling is one of comfort. We're trying to get back to some type of normalcy. Honestly, as a parent, I'm not worried at all. I'm so confident with this school, um, their procedures for cleaning, keeping the school clean. Parents I spoke with feel good about sending their kids back to school this year compared to four years ago. Students are now returning back to school after a surge in COVID-19 cases throughout Santa Cruz County this summer. But education leaders are saying there isn't a major concern as school starts. We haven't seen uh, a, a big impact of uh, COVID impacting the attendance uh, in our schools at this point, but we're just starting. The California Department of Public Health's guidelines say students and staff can return to school 24 hours after their fever is gone and symptoms improve. If a student isn't feeling well, Santa Cruz County school districts have supplies available. The things that we give uh, families uh, are uh, face coverings for them to wear, especially after recovering from COVID. It's uh, recommended for them to wear face coverings for up to 10 days. Uh, in addition, we have lots of tests that were provided to us by the state. Parents are happy to send their kids to school, gaining back some of the time that was lost. Four years ago, it was um, it was pretty sad because my daughter was in kindergarten and she had to stop coming to school. The county is monitoring disease transmission, recommending people stay home if they feel sick. Children heading back to school who have not received a vaccination are still el eligible. Sorry, reporting in Santa Cruz, I'm Brooke Kennebrew, KSVW Action News 8. Thank you.